Good evening, my YouTube family and friends, also known as the fans of LJ's Unboxing. Not to be confused with Lamar Jackson. That guy is awesome. Best quarterback we've had. I guess he's better, even better than Joe Flacco. Okay, now this is the review video for this phone right here. This is the Essential Phone, EH, Essential PH1, still phone. And, I mean, hey, I gave it a fair run. I used it the best I could. And it is an awesome phone for the most part. But this is not just a review of this phone. So if you like what you see, you can hit the like button at the bottom. You can subscribe if you decide to. And for a bonus, if you want to see more videos, there's very few that I make, um, hit the bell icon and you'll get notices every time I release another video. Okay, now, first, the phone portion. Now, <coughs> it's the only phone I have that's running Android 10. And it's the latest version of Android 10, which is the latest version of Android. It's a great phone for the most part, but... Almost immediately after I got it, I started looking at it to see the design aspects. And yes, while I did get this phone used on um, eBay, I didn't realize B would be so damaged. Now, it is a fingerprint magnet, but it is all scratched up. And it looks like they chipped away at the corners. I guess to try to see where the um, special metal separates, the titanium is, separates from the glass and the ceramic. But it looks like, other than the screen and the titanium, most of it is ceramic. So whoever decided to do this I guess they wanted to put a different screen on it because of the scratches which are so minor but they chipped the crap out of it trying to get the screen off and of course big old damage spot right there a little damage spot right there from them trying to get the screen off and of course there's damage spot there and damage spot there reason I know it's where they were chipping it trying to get the screen off is because there's a lot of spaces here, a lot of edges, that are not rough. And everywhere they tried to remove the screen, it's rough. As in, not manufacturer spec. So, this phone... Yeah, 100 bucks. Yeah, I mean, it seems like a good price for it, but with all that damage, it's all it's good for. It's the only thing that it's worth, at most. It's actually $99. And free shipping, which comes to other phones that I got from eBay. Now, they were supposed to be the best and, and new at that new so what does new tell you there's that piece of plastic you pull off for the official unboxing experience was it there on the other two no was not there so while they were selling it as new one was an open box uh yeah they pulled off a very important part of the unboxing experience because they're idiots. So would I buy from eBay ever again? Maybe. But it wouldn't be for a phone. That's for certain. Because they want to take away half the half of the unboxing experience. And for a YouTube channel, that's death. So sorry eBay. I might buy other things from you in the future. You're never selling another phone to me again. Three strikes, you're out. So, now, as I was saying, 
if you want to get this phone new or renewed, well, renewed, you're not going to have half that unboxing experience either, but new for 450 which is, in my opinion, too much for any phone, unless you're getting flagship specs, including an OLED screen, then, I mean, $200, fine. Okay. We can do an IPS LCD screen for 200 bucks. Uh, IPS LCD for, if this was new, 450 no, it's not worth it. Now, yeah, I like the fact that it updated to, it was already on Android 10, just because it was used, and it updated again to the newest version of Android 10, which is also a great thing. But other than that, and the minimalist, the fact that you don't have to deal with unnecessary apps that most companies actually put on their phones. But, I mean, other than that, yeah, you could do better with other phones instead of getting the um, essential PH1 or the essential phone. So with that in mind, we've got one more boxing coming up sometime this week. Uh, but as far as this goes, I'm calling this video done. And until next time, you just have a wonderful night. And who knows, maybe you'll subscribe, maybe you'll like the video, and maybe you'll look forward to further future videos. Till then, peace.